A Nash County woman accused of beating her granddaughter to death was recently reported to social services for suspected abuse. The eight year old died yesterday. WRL's Keenan Willard explains what we learned today about this investigation and the next steps. The sheriff's office says inside the family's home here in Nashville, they've already found multiple items that were used as weapons during this fatal attack. They're still working to find out why this happened. There was a grandmother that was arrested for first degree murder. Investigators continue to pull evidence from the home in Nashville where Patricia Ricks lived with her five grandchildren. The sheriff's office says one of those children called 911 yesterday. Nash County Communications received a call that a juvenile was being transported to the hospital by a grandmother. The Nash Sheriff's Office says eight year old Crystal Lane died before she got to the hospital. They arrested her grandmother, Patricia Ricks, charging her with first degree murder and felony child abuse. Ricks is being held without bond. Her first court appearance tomorrow. Arrest warrants show the girl died of severe blunt force trauma to her head and body. It was determined that the eight year old juvenile was beaten so severely that she died as a result of her injuries. So were any weapons used? Uh, we we have found some of those, but we're not at, currently going to release that at this time. Some some weapons or items were used as weapons at the residence. Today, the sheriff's office says weeks before she allegedly murdered her granddaughter, Ricks was reported to Nash County Social Services for suspected child abuse. There's a referral to determine if there was abuse in the home. Okay. Do you know who the complainant was? No, I don't. We reached out to Nash DSS to ask why action wasn't taken at the time of the complaint. The department didn't immediately respond. Sheriff's Office investigators say they're still working to find out why the alleged beating occurred. This incident is still under investigation as we are still trying to determine a motive. Keenan Willard, WRL News, Nash County. Now, WRL attempted to speak with multiple family members of Patricia Ricks for a response to her arrest. We have not yet heard back from any of them.